Just gonna pop some stuff into Discord. Go and that way. Right, uh, so we kind of left off here in this little nice little mansion of a certain something I can't actually read. That's his fault. And I believe I need a key I picked up. I'm down some health. Let's just eat up. Uh, I picked up. Well, I actually only have one key, huh? I mean, that makes things a bit simpler. So the only thing I actually have left is like the main objective of this level, and which is to find my way to the brothel called Dark Hollow. I got a key to upstairs room up here and there was a bit of loot but I have a feeling there's gonna be some more stuff as well uh, I did kind of have to knock out the guy who actually owns this place uh, kind of managed I kind of like run in ran into him like right at the top of the stairs there and uh, he wouldn't stop aggroing. I mean, I could just have run away some more, I guess. It's actually just a wall or something on the other side. So the the key you get from the guy's pocket lead into that room behind there. Is that a gold skull? Hmm. It's indeed a gold skull. I can't believe I actually missed like a giant golden skull just sitting on the floor there. But apparently I am that blind. Oh, there's some fruit behind as well. Uh, tablet with keyhole, probably gonna just snakes in strange manner, but nothing interesting. White keys to keyhole. Uh, bro brothel under fig. Fitchwick's hole, man. Uh, here we go back list, there we go. Yeah, Fitchwick's dark hole or the dark hole of ancient underground holes, apparently bearing keyhole and key symbols. An old moldy tomes filled with nonsense, some having empty passage. So that is a tip on how where I can actually find the brothel. Uh, under Fidgewick's Hollow, okay. And to turn off and the mule to confiscate tunnel access key if I can't take get to these holes and nobody can not on my domain. This is pretty much telling you how we're gonna proceed to actually find Dark Hollow. Uh, Where did he say it was? A brothel under Fidgewick's Hollow. Or it's close, canal, just touch an alley, old clockwork factory, something like that. There's no Fidgewick's Hollow on the map. There might be a sign like out in the street that should tell me where that is. 
But we do still need a key to get in there no matter what. Which is a candle. Yeah, I have gone live, yes. Good. I might... Okay, I have a bit of good boy and actually closed door be doors behind me, huh? Oh, unusual. Oh, I'm... I think... I definitely looted this last time. I uh, might have loaded a slightly old save. I didn't do anything really useful after this point, so... I believe what I... I have a feeling that it might... The key might be in the safe there if I can get that open. No. Hmm. Any switches or anything that could open it up? It might not be a operable safe at all. Yeah, so today we're mainly going to be running around trying to actually figure out how to proceed on this level. I've never been the best when it comes to actually... When the missions have like... Like, like puzzles you have to solve, I am usually pretty bad at them. Hmm. I think I've been pretty thorough in here. Yes. But there's nothing in here. Maybe I put... Uh, maybe if I close the doors? Nope. Thought maybe it might have like some sort of uh, safety mechanism that requires all the doors to be locked before it opens up. Uh, that looks reasonably solid. I have plenty of arrows. Yeah, that's pretty solid, yeah. Mm, how many water arrows? Four. Well, let's try putting out the torches just. That makes any difference. Nah, that's what I figured. I might as well test it, right? Can I pick up a fire arrow? Some point. If I did, I have used it up. Okay. That just destroys the arrow. Don't think there's anything else in here that I could find. Right. Uh, did I lock, I lock both doors? So I'm pretty sure there's nothing in there. Can't see any switches. Although I have been known for missing switches really bad. Like missing switches should have been pretty Oh hello there.
What? That seems important. Seems important, but uh, it doesn't seem to have done anything obvious like straight away. Hmm. So, there have been a couple of interactable objects in this level that I haven't been able to figure out what actually they actually do. I have this book carries a skull down underneath the librarian and there's also a set of levers which I haven't figured out. No, it doesn't open the safe. Can I use the key on it? Nope. Hmm. Can't hit it either. This is a more modern game, I might have expect like push and drag, but I like click once. I have a feeling this might end up being a level I actually have to look up like a walkthrough for. Let's see again. Uh so that tablet with a key or symbol which I haven't actually found. If from lie lips about the broth and the feature is hollow. Well, we got that Fidgewix hollow clue to go after. Uh, I guess we'll go down to street level again, see if we can't see any street signs. Oh no, this. Okay, so person. Okay, so person. The book upstairs opened this one. He'll shoot my shoot face. Okay, so we got something to go. Actually, I'll just leave off the open. I don't see any reason not to open. So press that one. Here's the guy. Hello there. Take that bottle, why not? Uh, just some cheap wine. Okay, so that might have opened some more doors or something somewhere. Hmm. Maybe upstairs again. I think go back upstairs would have been probably been annoying if I hadn't knocked the main guy out. So that's still solid door or solid wall, rather. Maybe the safe is opened now. I just have to be double check, make sure there's no other 
book, interactable books I have missed. Oh, there we go. Here's this safe. That's two stacks of gold or copper, whatever, and a key. The tunnel access key, nice. That is what we were after. Slow. I do wonder if they actually see if I just for sake of being sort of sneaky and role playing a bit. I mean, I have knocked the guy out, so he's gonna know something is, has happened. Hello, T12. How are you doing today? Welcome back, Scott. Let's try to push that again. I'm curious if it uh, if it closes the safe back up, or if I was just lucky. Okay, yeah, no, it's a one-time thing. Okay. That makes a whole lot of sense. I was a bit worried that, or rather, yeah, I was a bit worried with the books that they would like open the door and then close it again. Which we have made finding the door a bit hard. If it was, uh, since it was like just not right next to the bookcase. Uh, just leveling up my dudes in runtime. Ooh, nice. Uh, so which heroes do you actually play? I uh, mostly ended up get sticking to the uh, Iron Breaker War for now. Uh, I tried playing the Witch Hunter a bit yesterday, but I j I'm just too bad at dodge. I'm like absolute garbage at dodging, so I I die so much it's not even funny. Uh, yeah, I'm playing the, the second dwarf class, uh, the one with the flamethrower. Uh, so usually I end up actually getting more ranged kills than the elf. Let's see, so we got the tunnel access key. Should allow us to get in here, I hope. Uh, is there no shadows around here? No shadows, you have to just hide around the corner. Hello there. Is that it? That's a very tiny scroll floating around. Ah. Here we go, it's hidden again. Uh, is the beard... Uh, I don't know... Uh, do you mean if I play the dwarf because of the beard? Uh, not really. Mostly just because dwarves are kind of awesome. Especially in the Warhammer universe. Uh, I'm not sure if we want that on, to be honest. Let's try the lights off to start with. I have a feeling I'm gonna have to run back up and turn it, turn lights back on. Get through some door or something at the end here. Okay, but if you if you play all the character, which one is your favorite to play then? There's not enough shadows. That seems to turn the light back on again. Prefer the mage, okay. Yeah, tried play. Mage was the first one I tried playing, but I know the fl 
burning people was not as satisfying with her as I had hoped, and the squishiness kind of turned me off. Okay, so we got one guy coming up at the bottom there. Let me crawl into the shadows there just to be safe. Mm, I haven't heard the hope me again. Where's this? Where are these guys? Oh! Torch is very bad position. Oh, I think they're like patrolling on the sides of the room, which makes it hard to actually spot them. No, oh, huh. I'll actually patrol there. So he's going back in there. Can I be allowed to get out of here? Thank you very much. Hmm. Seems peaceful enough now. Okay, good. He turns his back. Okay. I was wondering how I was gonna get past the guy that's just standing there. Where does that window lead? Hmm. Oh, there's actually a guard standing outside there. Okay. That's possibly interesting. Let's see if they have anything interesting for me to go around poking at. Ah, okay. Yeah, no, this is probably... No, this can't be the other side. I thought that was the, that there's a place you can go in like right under here that has a similar set of gray door. Like, I mean, you can hear a bunch of zombies from the side of that one and I can't hear them here. I don't think this is the other side of that one. He's gonna come, our friend's gonna come back up the stairs right now. In a second. Yeah, there he is. I definitely should just have gone out the door there when he had his back turned. Who goes there? That not be such a coward. Oh, burger turned his turn. Of course, he turned around just as I was going down. I was a bit too slow, I shouldn't be hes hesitating like that. Uh, 
Oh god. Don't mind me. Uh, this morning you're gonna be having some... Some black... Okay. Don't know why that didn't... I locked that off, of course I did. Don't know why that didn't blind me as well. I'll find you. Damn you. Oh, there's a scroll again. I don't know why the scroll's blowing on the wind there. Come back out here, you tapper! I'm not sure this guy's ever actually gonna stop following me. Oh, sir. Hmm. Okay. Oh, apparently he is actually going back to his little room. Just gonna leave him there. Uh, I need to be a bit more careful when I go out here because the guy down in booth is gonna be quite sensitive to any disturbances for a while. There was some place to actually hide here. He couldn't actually spot me as well. Uh, I believe there are more shadows on the left side, so we're gonna go with that one. I think he's turned his back to me now. Okay, uh, do you want to just jump down or are we sneaking down in his shadow? I think jumping if we can manage to do that without making a bunch of noise. Here we go, perfect. Let's get the door open now so you gotta be careful about being spotted going past it probably just close it up i haven't seen anyone else i haven't seen the guy in the guard room and the guy patrol that i've knocked out at this point let's see 12 workers or men found one of the storage room vandalized a fortnight ago i don't really know what happened here but i suspect rogues are possibly a filthy critter maybe prowling in the tunnels and have caused the damage this is why I, Miller Vando, Warden of the Baronial Plumbing Division, has secured stout alert men to protect you and avoid unwanted accidents. I don't want to see anyone without a bodyguard as long as I believe the place is not safe. That understood? Talk to me if you have further questions. Okay, seems like a nice boss. I'm sure he's protecting his workers, not the brothel itself. The division only owns the machines, not the tunnels. With that in mind, remember that some sections are off-limits and probably filled with all kinds of rodents or taffers looking for a place to crash. Don't stray away from the lit areas and stay close to the hammer security machines if you value your lives. As you may know, my ability to recruit new muscle is because I secure a deal with, miss with the miss. Check the entrance every 5 hours every day. If someone's there, escort them to section 19, their belongings if they have any. You will know that these people are intruder or not by looking at the color of their clothes as a new color is chosen every day by your partner and will be communicated to you. Oh, hello, that's a door that can be opened. Question is, is there anything just that anything? It doesn't look like there's anything in the room to loot. 
looks that up. Sneak around to the window. Have a look in there once it turns around. No, that looks pretty empty, yeah. We'll leave him alone for a little and they guard. Just continue on. Oh yes, good old snoring. Let's see what do you have? Some coins or some food? Let's take the food, why not? It's your first day down here, and I guess the boss didn't tell you what your job is exactly. So read carefully. Inspect every pipe meticulously if you want to see if it's. Inspect every pipe meticulously to see if any of them are leaking. Don't you repair them though? This ain't your tapping job. Contact the section administrator first, and he'll send a gooey sand. Check the gauges every time you're in the tunnels. The pressure is too low. Ask the section administrator to evacuate the air out of the system. Most important task is to vent the steam out of the cooling system. To do that, you must first disable the secured lock and turn the second valve before turning the third. Okay, so this is probably important for how we continue on. Okay. You don't know, want to know what happens if you do it the other way around. Yes. Is this supposed to be for a security system in the castle? On to other matters, I guess there's one little thing the section administrator forgot to tell you. A tough lot of the places down here are not officially marked on any of the maps. Most of them are unused and in a state of disrepair. They ain't too terribly dangerous, but there are three of them that should be avoided. Waste pipe, there's some really nasty spiders to well. We ain't paid to hunt spiders, and the things are horrible, so don't go there. This used ventilation shaft that was supposed to bring us fresh air. The troglodytes built it, broke into some ancient ossuary, and they were so scared they skedaddled after breaking up the whole place. You can hear faint scratches and angry whispers near the place. Your recruits are often tricked to go in there alone, so I'm warning you. Finally, there's a system with loads of pipes, and one of them is leaking some kind of really murky gas that's think of the trickster himself. Not even Lois had dared to go in there in order to fix that leak, and this fellow works in slime all day long. You condemn the access door when the little solution could be found, but some idiot misplaced the key, and now we have to find a good enough locksmith. If you want to repair the damn leak. Anyway, there's no reason to go there in if you found that key. Okay. Yeah, I'm sure there's no reason for us to go there at all. Is that... I'm pretty sure that's not a valuable, I think it's just a hammer. Yes, it is a hammer. If someone don't hurt me... Just, just go to sleep. Yes, recovering blackjack you indeed. God, I mentioned knock out two people already this stream. This is I was doing I thought I was doing reasonably well yesterday at least. And measure of valves we can't touch so it's don't think any of these are useful either. Okay. Another place to hide if we absolutely need to is that. Not some place to hidden stuff. I can't even use the crate, so definitely not anything there. That's a bit different. Oh, 
Oh, I like that. Ah, oh, that's like an electric. Okay, what's a nice little touch? It's ruined here, but it sounds like there's a very faint kind of like a steam pipe or something going on there. More machines. That's uh, let's not stick our hand in there just yet. Oh. Oh, big warning sign. We like that. Uh, no, we don't like that. Warning periscopes in operation. We really don't like that. Good. Yes, it's just. Just continues the same direction. No, it does turn around. Okay. Oh, yeah. okay. I don't know if I should really continue after having triggered. Oh, it's actually following me now. Okay, that's kind of creepy. Uh, I have a feeling that screws everything up. Gonna reload just in case to fix something up. How did you spot me? I mean, it's not... It doesn't care about noise, so I don't really need to crouch, I think. Okay, we're good. I'm gonna stay crouched. I don't know if there are any more periscopes down here. It's gonna be humans from here on out. So here is the fabled section 19. Some water there. I don't know if we want to jump in or not. Uh. Kind of worried about not getting up if I go in, so you will kind of leave that for later on. Oh great, cute creepy music, that's perfect. So the fire in up. Fire machine you can't interact with. Another fire machine we can't interact with. Yeah, we got some more guards coming here. Maybe not right now, but there are definitely are more. Okay, 
the fuck was it that triggered right there? Here's an arrow for oh. you. You have to do better than that, Tapper. Okay, that kind of scared me. Holy shit. I don't know what I triggered. Like a periscope was just like, or was just the guard happened to come out. Oh! Right! Uh, that thing, right, of course I spotted that first time. Of course I've been spotting that one. Well, that's kind of awkward. Hmm. And I have to not sure if there's enough shadow or shadow close enough on either side of the door, but at least if I come from the other side. I'll have the luxury of actually being able to see the periscope as I'm preparing to go through the door doorway. Can't open the door at all. Oh, hmm. Crossing here is actually going to be a bit tricksy. Or not. Not sure if that blocks this line of sight or not, but okay. Uh, okay, good progress. Uh, I think there is some couple of people upstairs. What? Why? Garrett? Could you... No? Not gonna do any climbing today? Okay. Might be able to climb up there. Oh, there's actually a doorway right there. Never mind. I need to remember that this map has like metal frames on pretty much every single door and window. I don't think that was a thing in like the original game. I mean, I guess I technically am playing the original game, but yeah, I think that was a... I think it was that many of the metal frames in the original maps. I can't hear any footsteps, so I don't think they're patrolling, I think they're just standing by. You could also just have tried jumping. So I hear. The guys that clean the sewers? Keep the pumps working and all that? What? I hear they've been vanishing. Poof. Turning up and missing bits and pieces. I 
I think they're back on patrol now that they finished their dialogue. Uh, which is kind of bad that I couldn't really see any... Well, there was little to no actual shadows up there. To hide in. It doesn't seem to care to be moving anymore either. Nope, just rats. Nothing to worry about. Don't think you can hide for long. Come on, mate, it's just rats. Come on. Really? You know, take up spot right there instead. <laughs> wow, some embassies really don't deal well with being triggered at all. So this um this could definitely be classified as a bad situation. I think if you use a broader we can get him to move a bit more. Just where we shoot. Alright, what is that? Come out and fight me! Not to... No escape from down there. Come, come down and look at it, okay? You're a good boy. I know you're around here somewhere. <clears throat> no, I doesn't seem to want to move through the doorway. Why do you refuse to grab a hold of le any ledges right now, Garrett? Now you're outside, okay. Come back out here, you tapper! It's part of me she said that doesn't seem to be any way to actually like to roll up. Would jump up in the way. I think I need. I don't think if Garrett refuses to grab the ledge, there's not really a whole lot I can do other than knock the guard out. And he's resort and he's gone back to awkward turning again. Yeah, I think we're gonna need to knock him out. Oh no, we just instantly got okay. Uh... No, he's stuck in one of those. Fucking idiots. Yes, yeah, sometimes the AI does stuff like this, but I 
pretend that they're stuck or they pretend they're back normal but they are still in a they'll go instantly I as soon as they notice you and it did there we go okay wreck that one which means you just have to do it like that I guess this works well enough uh wait that's actually a better much better place to hide them Um, might have been able to, if I'd got snuck into this part, I'd probably, I don't know if it comes down here all the time or not. That's just because I made noise, but if I hid in there, it would probably just have walked down, gone past me, I could just continue on without any problems. At least one guy upstairs. He has his back turn. I don't know. He probably turned around at times. What's tile floor? Oh, we don't like that. Nope, we don't like that at all. I'm actually not sure if he turns around or not. That... He's not turned around so far. I think he's actually just busy ad admiring his weapon collection. Okay, don't open the chest because that's stupid stuff. It'll be awkward to get rid of without being heard. There we go. I'm not sure if I dropped the bedroll in the room, he would have heard me. Can I get the cheese though? <sighs> Which is a bit too far away to reach. Uh, it's just a cheese and a burnt out torch, nothing in this belt, okay. Here's a little list of the people the madam don't want to see loitering about anymore. Mr. Marfun, if it's not called already, Lord Odoral, Samuel Swarty, Send Four Fingers, I forgot to clap, Farin, Mr. Doublechin, Alga, the girls are afraid of him, the current Gorno will replace you at nine clean, things and five hands will then keep sharp. <coughs> Just keep your back turn and we will be fine, there we go. Okay, good. I uh, thought I heard him turn around. Oh, that looks like a hole I don't want to mess around with just yet. Sneaking up an incline is not a not fun. Can't pull that lever. Hello, hello. Is there anybody home? Uh, 
this is actually the way forward. I think. Oh, hello there. This actually might be the brothel. It opens a door at least. Don't, yeah, I don't have any maps for this part, of course I don't. Uh, I think the other way might actually... Yeah, pretty sure it's the way forward, yeah. Can I go back and check out the other passages first, I think? Jesus, God and a servant, okay. Ladder first, sure. I have a feeling that this might be different if I jumped down the into the water back a bit or not. Can I actually get back up here if I jump down? Yes, there's a ladder over there so I can climb that and jump back over. Okay. So I'm pretty sure this, oh god this, oh it's actually an air current stop, so, air current, water current stop me from, from going that way, okay. Carrot, there we go, thank you. This one's carrot can be a bit of an asshole when it comes to actually grabbing hold of ledges. You know what? We're opening it. We're opening this. I can't. Right, I can. What? what? Pretty sure this should be. Possible if Garrett stopped being an asshole for five seconds here. <gasps> well, that was the wrong place to grab, but sure. Here we go. Uh. <gasps> this is, uh, this is kind of polished. Grabbing hold of that one, uh, what I, then what I really want is to get lower part here. <laughs> Collision is weird 
here it's Oh great, and now I'm like completely stuck here. That's helpful. <sighs> Who the hell is this then? Okay. This is not too far back, I guess. I think I'll go check. Oops, that was. I don't know why I pressed that button again. Hey, what's that, noise? Yes, that is enough to make him make him alert at least. Not enough to get him to actually go on patrol though. Go and search. Yeah, I think this is actually the brothel. This looks like the way in. Okay, yeah, that. Thank you for confirming that, Garrett. I'm pretty sure the pipe I was trying. Either the pipe with the water current where I couldn't go in, or the pipe where I was trying to jump got stuck. Either of those uh, lead back to the staircase, I think. I don't know if there's one or two B player. Okay, just one, okay. Okay, you tapper. Yeah, gonna have to wait for them to stop searching for me. Uh where are you, you my bad I should have crouched before jumping down. The one yet patrol like down here goes up and into the hallway. I think I can if I go up to the end I can jump over down and hide in the shadow. That's what I was afraid of. No, I can't hide over here, can I? Nope. I was trying to be a bit too fast there and got caught. Again, just have to wait for him to reset. Well, obviously I gave up, so just go back to the patrol route, thank you very much. There's plenty of shadow there, the... 
I think the thing to do is like wait for him to start going down the stairs and then I climb up the stairs. I just wait here, wait, because there's not a whole lot of room to have to use up there without actually running straight into him. It's a little bit away so he doesn't accidentally bump into us. So he turns around. Wait here until it goes down. Go in here and hope the guy doesn't turn around in the kiosk. Shadows. That guy turns around. That gives us a lot of time to play around with this door. No idea what's actually supposed to be in here. Really? Okay, that's kind of disappointing. Okay. And then missed a key somewhere. Hmm. I could probably actually try to access the brothel just. I'll save before I do it, but should probably tr at least try to see if I can. Too late to go in there right now. If I hide here, he's not gonna bump into me. Good boy. I think the longest stretch I have is when he starts walking up the stairs again. I'll jump through the window. Sir? Who is that you? Nope, there's no one else in here. Completely imagining things. What? This, I have to say, this map is a quite a lot longer than I was expecting. Are you voltage, you say? Okay. Can't mess around with it. Who's there? Is someone there? Nothing here now. 
don't actually know how much that guy can actually see or not or if he's reacting to us. It's kind of refusing to turn around. Yeah, I'm playing like right at the edge of his wish. Why the fuck did he suddenly react right there? I don't get why he suddenly reacted. Any of the switches. I think you're gonna have to take a nap. Sorry about that. I've been trying to avoid knocking people out, but playing around the edge of playing on the edge of a vision like that just isn't gonna work. Yeah, I'm sure the guy patrolling outside is not gonna react to this to the guy standing in the booth suddenly being gone. Re really? Just just a flash bomb, that's everything that's in there. Okay, I guess. Who goes there? Who made that noise? Hey, stop. Nope, don't mind me. I've I'm in charge of this place now. I mean New guard, you might have not have gotten a notice yet. Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> yeah, there's a big room with no other exit. I wonder where I could have gone. Did yeah, I forgot to crouch before jumping down from the window, or I would have gotten away with that. Nobody talking about right. Uh, so I'm thinking that the door here might not actually be open just yet, and uh, something. Okay, never mind. Uh, that is actually all I have to. Let's make a proper save here. Yeah, the save says four hours, but that's a lot of. time spent not you know, like reloading and stuff. It's been at least an hour more than that. Probably, let's see, I've been going for an hour now, so also two hours more than that. Right, so we want to make sure we don't actually approach that door before I have explored a bit more. Yeah, jumping into the water makes a lot of noise. I don't know if there's any way I can actually avoid that. Just gonna you 
it doesn't react like single footsteps, but jumping in onto the iron was a bit too much for that guy. Alright, so we're back here again. I don't know if I'm gonna bother going back and trying to jump into water because I have to make There's one room with tile floor and a guard that all sent to this back. That's not that's not too bad. But there's that periscope ro room which might be a bit annoying right and then there's this this was this part was just this uh pipe. Something scared can be a little bit of a baby when it comes to climbing onto services or not. I'll be playing with the rope for a little bit, trying to get through here. I think you're meant to be able to. It looks big enough. It looks like you're meant to be able to go through. I don't know what the deal exactly is there. Just like sort of badly. If like they meant you to go through, they probably made like. 10% big or something like that. I think it's probably better to have it a bit closer. <sighs> Too many carrots. <laughs> yeah, uh, that did remind me I should probably eat up some more. Can't be a thief if you don't eat your food. I mean, it's clearly meant to be big enough to go through. So I don't know if that's a case of the people that made it just always happen to fit through. Just honestly. Come on, carrot. Come on. Hello Reb, how are you doing? Come on, okay, this feels like it's... There's something weird here. That's what looks like a secret door over... I wonder if... If maybe you're meant to come at this. It looks like I'm getting stuck like at the wall that the pipe is passing through. Yeah, nope. Uh, it, lo see, it looks like if I climb back up, there might, I might be able to get into that room from that side. Possibly. This was also a nope for going to right. Yeah. Donut Garrett mod. Just, just make every, just make Garrett's mod like fifty percent bigger. Why am I, why am I so bad at, bad at this? It's a simple jump. It shouldn't be that hard. There we go.
Right, so we got the end of the level that way, I can just go through it. There's a... A bunch of stuff I that I haven't figured out what to do with yet. And some of it's back up on ground there, so I think I might just end up ignoring it. No, there is like a... Oh, that's nice and bright. So we just have like right here. Feels kind of abuse. Like abuse to actually hide here. I know there is a uh, servant and a guard at patrol that comes down this way times that did something sound like it some of that noise came from down here. Obviously no one's been down here in a while. Uh, any plans to start with Thief 2 playthrough yet, by the way? Uh, it's... I still think it's gonna be after Breath of the Wild. Uh, oh right, this is the place they warned about with the spiders. Uh... I think what I might do is to s continue Breath of the like playing Breath of the Wild and something else like mix it up 50-50 something like that. Uh, but I want I want to play Hacknet first and then Bre then it's Thief Two, Thief Two, definitely. Mister Spider Boy. Garrett, could you? No, you don't want to hit. Yeah, Garrett is a pass. Garrett is against animal abuse. Okay, that is nice to know. You'd think after all the spiders at the end of Thief One, he would be a hundred percent for abusing spiders. At least killing them. So where is this gonna lead then? Yeah, I see. No? And this level is huge and there's still a second part to it. Oh? What oh, girls mine nice. Some wood and some cr oh a bunch of arrows. Sweet. Hmm. This did not lead where I was I thought it was gonna lead, but okay. Bunch of arrows and everything, yeah, I'll take that. Oh wait, there's mo uh, where's the black? There's the bullets, arrows. Uh, the small spiders are a bit too small to really hit with a sword. Kind of awkward to actually hit with a sword. They're a bit too small, if anything. Nurse. 
Oh, Nama Spider is coming as well. Of course I remember exactly how to fight the spiders. The fuck did I hit there? Oh god, Garrett, run, run. See, we got a healing potion. Uh, not that it goes mine, which, uh, I thought the gas mine might activate a bit earlier. And the only result is that I managed to gas myself. That's perfect. Okay, uh, spiders don't care too much about about the flashbang. Let's try to repeat this without dying horribly to spiders. I think everyone heard that. Nice to know. Um, unless Seven might be able to hit him from here. Turns his ass towards me. I yeah, should be able to hit it. Or not. Oh, might be able to back. Like, sneak attack him. See, the smart thing to do would have been to set up a trap for the spiders. I like put down the gas mine and allow the spiders to walk into it. It's been the smart thing and... Um, oh god, I'm actually... Kicking myself into a blind... I'm backing myself into a corner here, which is not good. Oh, never mind, I couldn't have put down the gas arrow since I didn't have it yet. Yeah, opiate. Really? Obviously, two baby spiders is too hard to just step over. Try full collision on those, those dangerous beasts. Hello, Mama Spider. Around here. Of the babies. Hey, wait, what? Where the f where did you come from? And why did you not I wait what? Okay. Why did you not activate the freaking gas mine? Oh, I th okay. I think that's actually everything down here, huh? Let's leave it at fighting you then. Oh, so that hopefully this big bad spider hasn't followed me. Come on, healing. Pop that one as well.
With a fluttering, yeah, and with the fluttering seek air pocket, sure. Hello there. Don't hurt me. How about you? God Take damn it. Alright, yo. Uh, I prefer not to, to get taught that lesson. Yes, perfect. Just gonna have to give that guy some time to calm down before I open the door again. Interesting that they have that whole section that you don't actually need to go through. Hmm. Let's see if he has stopped stopped being aggro yet. Most definitely not. As soon as I find you, you're dead. I was planning on letting you stay awake. Uh, me. Yeah, the alertness on this on the guards have been a bit weird on this level at times. I had one of the. They might. Hmm. They might be running into that one uh, guy I knocked out and being alerted over and over again. They're very right now about this guy, is it? Yeah, he's got a bow. Yeah, and this... Everyone's been acting really weird. Since I aggro them on this level, I've been acting really weird and like... What? How did you spot me this time? Yeah, they've been acting weird on this level, like as soon as I aggro them once, they aggro for all sorts of weird reasons. When you wouldn't think they normally should aggro. Like I had one guard that was like 20 meters or something and away from him and he had his back turned and I was walking through a doorway and like gravel or something or cobblestone and he just instantly alerted to me even though he was still on just normal patrol it's definitely I Definitely the alertness factor going on here. Mm -hmm. 
How is that guy gonna go on patrol again, or what is he still then? Kind of awkward to just sit in the shadow with a conscious body. Oh, there he comes, okay. He's gonna spot me. Got it. This is awkward on so many levels. Especially because now I actually get to appreciate just how love love poly this model actually is. Look at those good old fashioned edges. See this is what peak performance looked like. Nice edges on the model. Nice symbol in the mid on this jacket, which you can barely make out. Let's just You're not gonna move, are you? I would appreciate if you get it. Got to move on. See, even we, if I were to put down the body, which I'm... If I were to put down the body, I would probably alert him so I couldn't knock him out even if I wanted to. Turning around, really? Hey. Uh, then he spots me, of course. He he didn't seem in, he didn't seem inclined to move at all. Please stop following me. Is someone there? Nope, no one here. Who are you? Oh, oh god, he has a bow. It was bound to go wrong at some point. Right back here. Hmm. I think if I grab this body and put it down, put it down towards the spiders. <clears throat> Tempted to put him inside with the spiders, but I don't think he deserved that. Oh god, he was actually looking right at me. Wait. Wait. What? Why, why did he just end up stopping the last time right in front of me? I thought that since he stopped there last time that that was where his patrol actually ended. But I guess he was sort of like a 
sort of, like he was sort of aware I was there, but not really, I guess. Is it this is the bullshit I'm talking about with the AI? Is that sometimes when you look, when you have a look at them once, they get into this mode where they they don't even like. They don't even go, hey, is someone there? They just instantly start hitting you. What? You come down there? What the heck? Why would you go down the hallway? Why would you go down to the spider hallway? It's gonna spot. I put the body down there because I didn't think anyone would ever actually go in there, but apparently this guy does, so. Great. I'm, tr I'm trying to stop giving, stop with giving everyone headaches, but it's not like the AI let me. Without abusing the saving system. Something more in there as well. Nope, nothing just a... Wait, I can pick up. I think I want to check out. There was two more doors this way. No, I think he's. I think he's chill. Definitely gonna be like good. What's there? Uh, shadows. <sighs> Hello. I guess shadows not a thing you heard of. More periscopes. Okay. Uh. Ah, so this is the guy that spotted me when I came through there, okay. Very nice of them to actually warn me about the periscopes at least, if nothing else. What is the freaking... Oh god, and I'm all the way back here. Is this before now? I think yeah, this is after knocking out. Who's there? Who made that noise? Nobody, go back to relaxing. I refuse to play dead. Oh, hello there. Yeah, just like, go back to your post or something. So, what did 
we have here then? Oh, that just opened that door, okay. I guess you might as well have it leave it open so I can leave that way. Did that shadow move? Nope, no moving shadows. Turn back around. Perfectly normal. I figured it was gonna be some shadow I could hide in like right after going in there, but yeah. What the hell? What kind of a sewage, sy sewage plant system are these guys actually running? Okay, I don't know, sure, I'm sure it's gonna be coming handy. To the tasteful Taffer's prowling area, I have nothing against you even if you're a bunch of louts. But I must regretfully tell you that I was forced to raise the hubbub when you decided to use machines to hurt someone. Ah oh, yes, you miserable jackknouse, you broke a hydraulic wheel just to crush and tear some poor git's arm off. It's now beyond broken with a bloody arm stuck in there too. You recently set these contraptions to keep this, this keep this thing in city's electricity supply going. And your toughers wouldn't know the amount of work we have on our way even if it hit you in the face. I'll say it once on the one I'll say it once and once only, hands off my stuff. Someone really doesn't like people messing around with their stuff. Oh, I can see there's a guard up there, okay. That might have gotten awkward if I hadn't spotted his bow just sticking out. Hmm... No, that's... I think I can stick a rope around this surface, but in there it's actually like... Uh, brick roof as well. Where the hell am I even making my way right now? I can't believe that all of this is just... Side stuff that's there for fun of it, I guess? Not sure if it does doesn't really look like they are a type to start moving. I can probably sneak behind them. Is that anything valuable they got to go in there? Nope, just some food and some cheap wine, okay. Mm, I could Probably use the shadows to climb up the bridge as well if I wanted to. <laughs> yep, the 
There he goes. And this is over there. I, think I... I just love when the edge of the vision is just at the edge of where, the, where you need to go. I can't believe there's so much. That's just. Oh. I mean, I guess most levels actually have a bunch of optional stuff, but this seems a bit excessive. Hello there. He found a dead guard. Oh, this is not a good situation. Uh, so I feel like this guard. Yeah, probably interrogated and beaten to death. Great. We got another friendly guard coming this way. See anything? Oh, hello there. Just okay. Just a chest. Oh, and an arrow. Oh, rope arrow. Nice. Let's just. I don't think anyone's gonna come through the door, but let's just crouch for sake of it. Yeah, just in case someone comes through. What? Okay, that's not what I expected. That's not what I expected to find inside a log chest, but okay. Yeah, it's definitely coming this way. Sort of broken door in a guard that's off triggered by another dead body. Okay. Maybe that's the guy. Maybe the dead guy there is the one that's been running around messing with their stuff. Oh, this is going to be too bright. Too late to move at this point. <sighs> sure, you would spot me there. That's not really what I was thinking of. I'm more surprised that door actually led back here, but okay. Lost them. You better hope I find you before the guards do. Wait, you are one of the guards. Right, I'm back here, okay. <laughs> when did you come up there? <gasps> huh. Too many damn rats around here. Hey, 
Oh, something's wrong here. Over there. Swear I, was I know you're out there. You, I'm gonna take my I'll time with you. Oh, fuck me, everything just. Hmm. It's quiet now. God, this is going bad right now. Uh, no real safe place to hide either. God knows what state everyone is going to be in right now. I don't know why the why I made a noise jump and I was crouched before jumping. Or I dropped him down. And they're probably meant to get stuck between themselves and the door. Nope, okay. Okay, so he just walks. Hey. Well, it was nothing, I guess. Huh. I thought I saw something. Nope, you didn't see anything. Just me checking if you're there. Hmm. Quiet now. Oh yeah, no, we don't want to jump into that tank. That looks like it's gonna be so good. Oh, that is okay. That leads okay. Uh, that's just back to the little waterway place right next to the brothel. <sighs> yes, I want to get up on those walkways a bit. Looks like a wooden beam. I could probably rope arrow up. Let's uh, give that a sh bit of a shot. Quite literally, actually. Or is that actually metal? I think that might actually be metal, yeah. Whoops. Okay, uh, I'm gonna need a quick little break and a uh, little toy break now. So we're figuring out how to get up there after, after that.
Yay. Uh, let's see if there. I don't know if there's any good place to actually get up. So that just leads back. That, that's fine. That. Uh, actually, that's not fine. At least that leaves at least. I was thinking I could use that like a short hit and basically just run back out. That still leaves. At least that little tunnel where I can't get through the pipe. I haven't explored. Thing. Just that's a bit too high up. Huh. Too many damn rats around here. So we're gonna put you in with your little buddy. What? Okay. Randomly getting stuck there, great. I think uh, actually. I should narrow. Yes, I can. Good thing I noticed there was a slightly. But it helps us eat neither of those. Those are actually interactable. Ah. A miss. Okay, a mysterious key. Okay. Is there been any door I haven't been able to open? There's been plenty of stuff I haven't been able to. Uh, I should probably want to take the rope arrow with me. <gasps> yeah, neither of these doors actually work. Hmm. Uh, that's kind of awkward. Uh, what? Yeah. Jump up and grab it. There's still a yes. So. There's still a couple of places left I want to check out through. Just grab the key, grab the arrow. Mm. I'm thinking... Wait, I went a completely different way this time. And this level, this is a long level. Hello Zola, how are you doing? Oh my god, thanks a lot for the host. Yeah, is this a party? How are you doing? And how did the race go? 
that's uh yeah still fan map it's it, it's actually the same fan map i've been playing for the last two streams uh it's quite a long one and i could yes 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 you could swear you could see me yada yada yada, yada. I could just run to the exit right now, uh, but there's all this stuff to explore. So if I go back in here, I trig managed to trigger. Uh, so there we go. I managed to trigger these two guys earlier, so I don't know they might be a bit aggro on me if i try to do anything in this room right now uh we forgot one key spot in tomb of giants we're basically all the way we're basically all the way through the dlc before not saying oh and that was the one that led to the depths i gave up on manners and ran there as soon as he figured it out i finished the game just shy of five hours Nice. Hey, okay, did you see that? I think I saw. Well, it was nothing, I guess. Why is there a guard up there at this? I was sure it wasn't a guard up there the first time I came through. Just give good night potions to both of us. Oh my, oh my god! Five five months, thanks a lot, Sola. I really should get around to getting some getting some uh, emotes for you, to be honest. <laughs> hey, maybe if you weren't such an amateur you wouldn't make so much noise. <laughs> Oh, well, when I find you, quality insults right there. Guess it was nothing. Uh, it's kind of gonna be awkward. Love key shit talking guards, yeah. yeah the, the guards actually have quite a lot of nice shit talking if you manage to trigger them. No? Okay, I think he spotted me. It's like, sort of low key spotted me. Gotta play this soon. Reserve like one day a week for Gone. now for new games. Oh, that, that, yeah, it's probably. Uh, it's nice to have a bit of variety. Yes, 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 yes. The usual shit talk. You're stuck up there, and I'm stuck down here, so just ignore each other. Please tell me you haven't. I'll find you eventually. Please tell me you haven't uh, put more bodies in these two chests. Oh, more gold. Oh, yeah. Uh, also, for anyone who don't already follow Sol Davids, he does a burn off. Mm. Yeah, Nightbot is back as well, nice. So, burn off uh, Dark Souls races and stuff. Mm. Yeah, I've been, I've been this close for like half a month now. The Breath of the Wild gets a bit boring, I guess, to watch. See, so... How do I actually get... Where I find you, so actually, I'm gonna take my time with you. 
Yes, yes, yes. If you could just like pretend I'm not here while I fumble around and make all the noise in the world, that would be appreciated. Uh, I think it. I think I might not be meant to actually get up there. Just you know, casual observation. Just poke your head out. I'll end it for you, quick like. Yeah, huge RPGs are tough since it's easy to lose to continue. Continue. T He's dead. But what? When I find you, I'm gonna take my time with you. Why is there a guy downstairs there? Did he manage to bug himself down? And I mean, at least in, in least, at least in Breath of the Wild, a lot of the. You can't hide forever. I'm gonna finish you, Garrett. How did you get down at all? Ah! Oh God, where did I save? Hmm. Fuck. I Fuck that sloped floor to us a metal grate. Too many damn rats Seriously. Around. Fuck that. So we should accidentally step on it. Huh? Yeah, Breath of the Wild, there's, there's a lot else. of just running around without really doing anything. Especially like when you go like uh Especially like if you like go shrine hunting and stuff. Grab me some homemade dinner really quick my folks. Feel like not having to cook for that mess of her of that mess of her. Oh, nice. Oh some more yeah, that's the wine. I like 20, okay. Just quickly up here. Don't I feel like I should be able to like climb on top of one of these tanks and up onto the platform. Seriously, was that guy up there the entire time and I just didn't notice him my first time through the room? This looks like a much saner way of getting up there. Uh, why can't I lean right now? Or crouch? Just poke your head out. I'll end it for you, quick like. You're gonna have to do. Th it's nice that you can, if you do like lean forward, you can. Hit people just before I discover you knock them out if you do it right. Otherwise you get narrowed to the knee and get killed. For, I need. This is kind of awkward to do. Because if you look. I still haven't figured out entirely how. What the rules for mantling actually is. Because sometimes I. Manage to just grab onto it really easy. And sometimes not so much.
Yeah, I need to sort of. Yeah, I need to actually move. I think I need to hold for as well. <sighs> There's the fact that I have to actually crouch in like. Got like a small gap where I need to crouch. You're not one of us. This is definitely out. awkward. That tickles. Oh, shut up, dude. I mean, it just shoots me. I don't think there's actually anything up here, but now I want to be able to do. Now I want to tr actually be able to make it. Uh, I mean, the obvious solution, if I'm not being stupid, is just with a moss. Oh, yeah! It's. Put me in that. It puts me in a weird boy. position there where I'm not actually s s sort of standing on top of something, but I'm not really either. See, so if I sneak up here, I should be able. Uh, what are you doing, game? Why are you pushing me? That's really not help. I'm trying to hit like up the roof. What the? What kind of collision are we working with here, game? Come on. God knows where it's actually landing right now. I think that hopefully works. You're not one of us. I mean, what? And I still made noise jumping down. What the hell is this place? And I can't simply shoot them either. And now there's definitely moss up there. <sighs> Why is this so fucky to jump up? There we go, finally. Now it's just a matter of actually sneaking up on this guy without him spotting us across a metal surface. Did I just see what I think I saw? Come on out and play. You're not one of us. Of course there's not. Yeah, there's nothing up there. I'm giving up. Freeze. Is that asshole out there? Do I do? Do you have a healing potion? Let's use that. Just locked. Did I? I did leave a guard out here, didn't I? Is 
just casually sneak past this guy. Out the back, probably is not watching that light. Oh, okay, no collision, okay. Yeah, sure you got to stop jumping at nothing. Oh, you how? Oh, bugger. Uh... Right, I guess we're going back and closing the door then. Seems clear enough now. Yeah, just stand there while and don't react at all while the door randomly closes. Okay. Sometimes collision is not entirely 100%. Now he can't actually spot me. It's good. Any levers to pull? Nope, there's a... That looks interactable. Is someone there? Oh, this fire's a bit bright, isn't it? Don't hurt me! Help! Help! Don't let him get me! Ah, come back here! Just reenacting the painfully slow killer with the incredibly inefficient weapon. Warning! Lucius Gas keep out. That sounds bad. Uh, let's hit. Yeah. Uh, I don't know why I was expecting to stay hidden while I'm right next to this giant fire. It was clearly. I was clearly not thinking straight. Yeah, the gas doesn't seem to be doing that much. Okay, this is perfectly normal and fine. If nothing else, that's quite an interesting. Okay, you get an end that over there as well. And some spiders somewhere, kind of hard to tell with everything moving around like this. Warning, you're reading a sign. Uh, I think that's meant. I don't think that's spider. I think that's meant to be the mushrooms. I think this whole section is just like sort of a for fancy section. Oh. 
I'm not sure who I knocked out, but okay. Okay, let's uh, let's just stick around there. That doesn't seem like it's gonna be good for our, our health. Okay, mysterious. There we go. Clean up, back up, nice and. Nice and well, and I can't turn any of those. Which leads us back here. Yeah, completely imagining things. Oh, well. Just ignore me. Don't know what it was. Turns around and we wait until it turns back. Out through the door. Oh, turn back around. Goodbye. Turns around the. He's turning at this well. Standing. Yeah, it's probably meant to be enough time for this. Sneak past the end. Oh god, okay. That's a periscope. I did not realize that was a periscope until I was. Well, until I said it, I said it. Yeah, you should just stop caring about the rats, to be honest. <clears throat> so what do we have in here? Okay. The sewer section of this I figure the sewer 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 section would just be like a quick little thing. Holy shit, it's turning out to be about as big as the main section, of, like the main city part, huh? <laughs> the... What does the sign say though? Mortal danger, high voltage, okay. Check in here first. Wait until the periscope turns back around. <coughs> Thought I saw something. What's that? Hey. The alarm. Okay, uh, figure. <coughs> hmm. If I stand in the middle of the room, I can actually observe. That guy seems to be looking di out in, like, basically towards his door all the time. That guy has his back turned. It's 
Oh, very possible knock that guy out. That guy is gonna be interesting. Anything <coughs> worth knocking? I'm gonna knock you out. For the alarm! <sighs> Fuck me, the, the periscope spot me through the tiny gap in the window. Can't actually close, okay. It's actually nothing worth stealing here. So you need to be pretty visible for the telescope to actually. Yeah, that's good to know. So we can't do anything about that guy, which... I think the reason that guy over there that we knocked out was looking this way was so he would catch you going into this door here. Oh, there's more over there as well. <coughs> Good thing they are completely stoned, or they would have heard. There's no way they wouldn't have heard that. So, what do we have down here then? Oh, okay, yeah, and I see where I am right. Okay. Yeah, on one, I think, yeah, this is right on the way we... When are they going to bring me my dinner? That's what I want to know. When are they going to bring me my dinner? The fuck is he? Yeah, like, right up here is where we knocked out one guard. And why <sighs> is this hoover system so exp expensive? When you don't really need to do like even five percent of it to finish level. Mm, nope, I can't do anything up there. Oh, finally, I got this section. And you said, see here now we're at the other side of this stupid pipe. Which allows us to go out perfectly fine. Okay, so when we come from this section it's completely fine, but coming from the other side that's completely unacceptable. That's a fake door. Uh, this looks like it might be openable from the other side. 
Then they used to be a bunch of... Why is this even here? Oh, right. I didn't actually knock that guy out, huh? That explains who was scrambling. Uh, I'm just trying to think if it's... We faster to go out through the pipe. And all the way around or just go up. Hmm. There's still one thing I want to actually mm. that scared me. I don't leave that open. Sure, why not? Did you huh? see something? No. Over there! Oops. Too much coffees this morning. I'm twitchy as hell. Yeah, stop seeing stuff. All quiet now. Must have been rats. See that there? Stop very much about those steps. Is someone rats. there? Hey. <sighs> hey. Can't hide for long. Okay, hello. What? When I find you, you'll regret it. Help with me and your crow meat, Tapper boy. Oh, he just fuck me. He just clips through the wall. Okay. I kind of expected to just be safe once I got to the other side, but yeah. Apparently he, they just clipped through that wall, so I can't just jump over it to be safe. Uh, I think we're gonna look, uh, be looking at knocking a couple of taffers out there. <laughs> Didn't, yeah, I don't think there was any way to actually get through here without... Oh, I mean, I didn't really start noticing until I was jumping around, I guess. Yes, we found a... I'm making so many saves here. Oh, that looks nice and friendly. We found what looks to be an old abandoned crypt of some sort. Wait, is this gonna is this gonna lead back to the underneath the librarian guy? Well, there a bit more loot. Well, then that the door doesn't seem to open. There was a like a librarian alchemist guy that had a secret crypt underneath his house. So I'm wondering if this is gonna lead back there. And there was a interactable skull thing there that I the f is that a ghost? There was like an interactable skull motif thing there that I couldn't figure out what it's supposed to do with. Darkness shall overtake you. 
The seasons move faster, invader. Uh, what? What the hecking heck is this? I hope this does these doesn't count as human. It doesn't seem to be hitting too hard. Uh, I shouldn't let them get down the stairs since Oh they might just murder me. They get seven from there and then just nope through that door. Is it possible to get? Is that guy always just gonna hit that going no matter what? Or. Yeah, I think he, yeah, he just does that whenever you... Like, really? He just does that whenever you steal the necklace. Uh, I'm just gonna get them out of the staircase so I can run past them. I guess we're just grabbing up and running then. Oh god, they... Oh, what? Okay, they came from a different... They came from a different direction than what I was expecting. I'm pretty sure it's like... I'm, there's a bunch of stuff I'm... Is he leaving behind in this map? Uh, see, I'm gonna I'm gonna head back up to the guard to the guard that I thought I'd knocked out, but hadn't actually knocked out. I'm gonna head up to that guard I thought I'd knocked out and actually knocked out. Okay, there they are. Uh, and get around the other part here. Yeah, so I actually don't dare open that one. Just uh, say first. To arms, all! There's no way to actually open that without and have any idea of state of the periscope. The alarm. Like what the hell am I guess we're taking the long way then. Because that's certainly not happening. Yeah, I want to I think when I hit the switch up there, I opened the door <laughs> that then I think. Uh, so I'm just gonna run back around, uh, sneak across that bridge to see what's up there, and then we're gonna head out. Who the heck is that? And then we're gonna just head out to the next part of this mission.
some weird and bad collision at parts there. Which is not great. Just gonna jump off again. Yes, you know. Oh my god, this is more awkward than necessary. Uh, at least from my part. Okay, go. at how long this level is and there's gonna be a bunch and even with how long I've taken it's gonna be a bunch of stuff I haven't actually picked up on the way there's gonna be at least 500 I'm going to go out of my way and guess a thousand loot at least I haven't found. Huh, that went a lot easier than I had expected. We can't be messed with. Can't be messed with. I just love doorway doorways where you have to stand in light to open it. It's like back to start, right? It's the way back to. S Where the hell are we right now? The. F Oh! We're right back to the start of the sewer system, okay. I knew this section was looking familiar. Hello, welcome back, Sola. Oh, uh, periscope in action, mmm. I'm gonna make a quick save just so I can check what was actually... There was some water... Oh my god, that, that was... that was close. This was a bunch of water on here I'd never... Try to jump in, so I'm gonna try that. See where this leads. And after this part, we are definitely gonna just go to the next next section. Yeah, this uh, this led exactly where I thought it was gonna lead. Okay, just making sure. So I could have skipped a bunch of stuff if if i just jump down instead of going down going down the stairs properly that is nice i i'm gonna be curious to see how much loot i've actually left behind i'm not <laughs> expecting the status page to be be nice to me to put it not to put that way There'll be so much loot I left behind. Ok, 
Because no normally I feel like I have looked pretty much everywhere. I still miss like 500 loot. This time I don't even feel like I looked everywhere. There's a bunch of stuff I've not finding. Let's actually make a... Uh, And mission one save. Yeah, about a thousand loot. Spent five, yeah, five and a quarter hour not taking into account all the reloads and stuff. Oh, 18 knock... <laughs> oh my god, 18 knockouts when I'm trying not to knock everyone out. Oh my god. The Chalice of Souls is rumored to be in this brothel. brothel. Locate it and steal it. Clientele is compromised of all sorts of noble who hold secrets, and the secrets are easily uncovered in establishments like this. See if we can find some registry or ledger containing information. Who knows? This could come in handy for future jobs. This brothel, brothel attracts a wealthy clientele that desperately needs to be relieved of its riches. Don't leave the premise without snatching at least 2,000 worth of valuables. I don't kill anyone and find a way out once all the other objectives are completed. Nice. This show looks like a nice brothel. Did I double check? No, I definitely just uh, start with like a default set of equipment. Okay. Yeah, don't, yeah, I don't think this game has the. Yeah, thief don't carry any equipment or anything over from mission to mission, which I guess makes designing the difficulty a lot easier. So have more control of what the player actually has and have and don't have. Right, that's tile floor. If you could just sort of oh bugger. You. Show yourself. I think that's uh <laughs> I think that's new personal record and getting caught on level. I think I'll really enjoy these games. Yeah, if you like stealth games, you should really enjoy this. And I'm, I hope you do end up playing it because I'm really looking forward to seeing you play through the first one at least. <clears throat> Thought I saw something. Of course you didn't see anything. Nothing what now. makes you think that? Uh, I don't really have anywhere to hide yet on this level, which makes getting caught a bit awkward. Of course, the solution is just to not get caught. 
first place. That is probably a horrible idea for my part, drinking energy drinks at 9... 9.30 p.m. That's gonna come back to bite me when I try to sleep. Mm-hmm. I'm pretty sure they got into that weird AI position again where they really have, they are still a bit alert. I wouldn't sleep all night. Yeah. Uh, I guess we'll see how I end up doing. What's going on over there? Good boy, don't pay attention to me at all. Don't just the wind, I guess. Don't pay attention to the guy behind the curtain. A lot of flight, I think I'll wait for the guard to make another round. Just to give me a bit better better time to sneak out here. Uh, we got another guy like right to the other side of the curtain, which I don't know how to deal with yet. <coughs> Suppose you have anything on you doing? Nope. Okay, so he definitely is turned around part of the time. It's just with this guy patrolling as well. Uh, kind of a short timing window right there to sneak in. Over there. Someone there. With the curtains and everything, it's kind of hard to actually get a read on when it's safe to go or not. I mean, obviously the easiest solution would be just to knock out this guy. Someone there? Hello? Anyone there? Yeah, I guess not. I see you there. But Show your first, I can't tell which way you're facing. Let's got them curtains in the way. And I'm pretty sure I'm not sure if the curtains block him from seeing me or not. If I just 
The curtains made that unnecessary hard, I think. In a nice for effect, but they made it really hard to actually know when you could could not go. Uh, that's that's kind of an awkward timing for actually sneaking past. Or, uh, I guess they just are not really synchronized. Okay. Do I have any? No, no maps. That's what the no map screen looks like. This is a lot of people I have to sneak past. Jesus Christ. <coughs> well, thank you for that creepy ass music just as I inhale. Let's see that. Seems to be a bedroll or something. Yes, I don't think there's anything valuable. Oh, it's actually a newspaper. Okay. Incident at the bear pits. Nice. Nice reference there. The incident occurred at Glimwater Pit this Steam's day. The bear weighing close to 1,600 pounds. Left over the barrier and harmed three spectators, including the Honorable Lord Bacchus, whose stays are not in danger. The animal managed to escape the pits and terrorize the neighborhood before being killed by Sir Sawyer and his alert men. Are the bear pits safe enough? Our experts debate small page 5. Uh, killed by heavy rains and nificious because a serious flood damage felt man and caused importantly. Caused important deterioration from Cloister Lane to Ghost Crossway. Da, 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 da. Okay. Yes, I had that creepy music trigger already. I didn't need to put go through it another time. Uh, I think I can go and hide in that corner over there as well. Oh god, so many people. Why do you not have a per gold purse on you? That's just... That's just plain rude. Because you have a guard goes in like a... Certainly have those two. There's a prostitute. Not nearly as dark as I was hoping. Oh, uh, yeah, it's those fluctuating lights that are always kind of awkward. How many water arrows do I have? Five. Hmm. Yeah, I would very much prefer if it didn't look over this way, but sure. Is someone there? Yeah, this is not a good hiding spot at hmm. all. It must have been rats. Probably positive. Who are you? Guards! There's an intruder here! What? Okay, I mean, good. I was 
I only really saved because I didn't want to waste the arrow. My god, that other NPC there is gonna. That noble man is totally gonna spot me. Or not, huh? Yeah, I mean, I don't mind not being spotted. I actually kind of prefer it. Oh, I hate that. Is that guy, did we have this the guard going up? Don't know the prostitute. Yeah, he's gonna come back in a second now. I think I'm gonna try to sneak in after him. Like climb over. Where is that? <laughs> oh, God, that's uh, shadows. Who made that noise? Who is there? Who are you? Help! He's armed! Why is there no Why is there no shadows there? Come on. No idea where I'm supposed to be able to go right there. Definitely a shadow here. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, this is definitely a much better place to start from. Music track on this level, you don't need that. Should have been a bit better, I think. You don't need that tense build up. Okay, it's okay. There's you coming back. This would probably be pretty easy just knocking everybody out, but yeah. Okay, locked. Never mind me, I'm just gonna intrude a bit on their privacy here. Just that guy. <laughs> only to Why do you only have 12 coins, you cheapskates? in the next room I can actually hide. Nice and quiet. 
There was a silver fruit there and a moss arrow over here, so not really a whole lot I actually steal in this room. Yeah. Now that I know what's in this room, I could probably have done it without knocking anybody out. Uh, the rod stone is done. Uh, let's just move the bodies. Just gonna drop them all in the bed and um, yeah. Just pretend they all fell asleep doing a mass orgy or something. Oh, possibly if I not if I water arrow the uh, fireplace. could hide behind there, that's possible. I think it's stop with the music, that would be nice. Uh, oh, that's a valuable waste. Like 70 gold is waste. Why did you suddenly alert me there, but okay. Oh, great, now I'm back here. Huh? What's that? Hey, is someone in here? Oh. Good lord, guards! No, no guards. Uh, right, Moss Arrow. Forget about that one. I don't know why the guard I go to me there. Oh god, this is bad. I think I was standing a bit too close to the guard and he... For that, <clears throat> don't no, don't come searching for me, please. Jesus Christ. Hmm, I'm starting to see things. I better get some rest. Okay, I'm wondering if I could hide behind the curtain there. There's like something else there. If not to try to sneak in. And I thought left there. Oh great, just everybody spotted me. Perfect. This level is annoyingly well lit. And open. Which makes it uh, kind of hard to do. I mean, I, of course, I could just go back to knocking everybody out. So I might almost need to do to be even able to do this. I think you, you spotted me. I think they're. That is definitely a possibility. I think there might be one of the women coming along as well. Hmm. 
I don't know how curtains affect people's ability to see you. I'm... Isn't it should stop them, but kind of hard to be sure. <laughs> Oh, he's out of the red. Jesus Christ. Huh? Hmm. I guess it was nothing. <laughs> yeah, the audio is directional, yeah. Or I... You can... You can choose to have e EAX on. I don't know if it's directional without it. But if it's set up properly... There's someone there. Right. Uh, there's, it's supposed to like uh, take into account doors that's between you and the person and and like, w how many rooms there are and distance and everything. So the audio is really well done. The, the main issue with the audio is when there's people that's like on, a, on the floor over and under you. It doesn't deal with that like vertical distance at all. So yeah, the audio is really well done. You can... I mean, this level is a bit too busy for it, at least so far. But a lot of the time you can like sit and listen at the door and tell where in the room they are just based on the noise they're making. Nothing. Especially since pretty much every surface has like a different Who's there? sound. Is someone there? Oh well. Don't know what it was. What's that? <clears throat> Over there. Hello? Anyone there? Glad it was nothing. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure about I don't uh, help. What was that? Help. There's someone hey, here. What's that sound? Here. He has a I'm not entirely sure I'm being able to Please don't hurt me. I see him. Help over here. Oh my god. I'm really not sold on me being able to actually do this. On me being able to do this uh, without knock just knocking every single person out. Oh, <laughs> I only have five water arrows, so I'm, uh, I could knock out the candles over there. I should give them enough to hide there and sneak in, steal the stuff. Uh. But I only have five water, so I'm not entirely sure if it's actually worth it or not. <clears throat> yeah, it takes two water hours to put out both of them. Can't just shoot in mid later. I think I heard something. Will you put make a noise? I think I heard something. 
It's, it is a really nice game. I would definitely recommend it if you're looking for some more stealth game. Oh. Uh Never mind. Uh I can just put the I can just extinguish the candles by hand. Look there. See anything? No, I didn't see anything. Go. Oh, Away. Wow. Don't know what it was. What was that? You're putting candles out with your but using arrows makes everything a lot easier, for sure. Who's there? Who are you? Help! He's armed! Help! Somebody! Oh my god, so much... <laughs> so much saving. Who's there? Is someone there? Hmm. Hello? Anyone there? Have you just stationed yourself there now? Oh god, M NPCs moving and messing up the patrol routes. Oh my god, this that's... That's bad. That is really bad. Because mm, I can't really. Yeah, with that guy standing there, he's blocking her, which ends up, which means she's always looking right where I'm trying to go, which just stops me completely. I guess I might have made a noise that made him start going investigate. Okay. Well, I guess we're not robbing that room then. That asshole standing in the way. I don't know. We really are coming this way. Oh my god. Uh, this might get a bit tight right here now. <laughs> you see, that's... That should not be correct behavior. I'm pretty sure that's not correct behavior. Usually guards... You should have like a cup <laughs> of seconds to react when a guard. A couple of seconds. You should have like half a second to a second. A guard spot you to before. Or actually starts hitting you. Who's there? Is someone there? Huh? Nothing here now. Is someone there? Hmm. Thought I saw something. Copy. Nothing here now. Glad it was nothing. <clears throat> Is that you, Kevil? No, it's not Kevl, it's never Kevl. Oh, well. Sorry, guess it was nothing. I, I don't have any money. Help! Uh, that's the wrong eye. Oops. Was that you? Oh, there's. Put him 
Man, there's so many people on this level. Uh, I think I'm actually gonna have to start knocking everybody out. Who's there? Holy sh... I never had guard speed... Guard speed this... Seems quiet enough. This trigger before. Yeah, you're definitely going to have to just go knock out crazy in this one. Good thing you have a nice room to just dump all the bodies in and... A thief I see before me? Guards! Guards! Well, there's definitely too many people to not knock out everyone. And maybe not everyone, but we're gonna get to go quite thorough right here. Normally the levels are not this dense with NPCs, so normally it's not this hard to do it without Not that I've been able to not do it without knocking everyone out at any point, but yeah. I mean this is probably the most people I've seen in one as together in any one level. And a lot of them are, seem to be a. They generally seem to be a bit more attentive to stuff happening at like the edge of the vision than they normally are. We are stuck there as usual, of course, because why would they not be? Yeah, so just thin. Oh my, oh my god. Help! Thief! Thief! And I'm back to ne not remembering to save as well, which is not making things easier. <clears throat> She seems really upset. Did you steal her panties? Nope, I didn't steal anyone's panties. I did knock out a couple of people. And for a place that's absolutely filled to the brim with people, they seem to be a l they seem to be really paying attention to footsteps. And hello Megalonix, how are you doing? Just me just make sure no one's like super upset right now. And if not, I think that's good enough to make a I'll save, yeah. Okay, glad to see you on. Yeah, I've just not been fe feeling it. Feeling it quite lazy for this last week, so 
I've been streaming too much. Just sometimes you just. Sometimes it's just like, do I even do I even have enough? Even if I fuck to even turn on Netflix. Yeah, it's not dealing with people. It's just not really doing anything at all. Just generally end up just turning on a stream or Netflix or something, then I do nothing else for the rest of the day. Even if I had all the plans. Okay, that is nice. So the small amount of noise I made messing on with the guard was enough to get that man in the hood there to to get moving which allowed the prostitute to move as well nice uh, so just need to wait for that guy in that room of oh her out of the way I should that's that guy I should enough to sneak over and I should do this stuff now. Uh, I wish I could just stream and have friends show up. Dealing with random assholes has been stressing me the last few times I streamed. Doesn't sound good. Uh... This guy has, has a reasonable patrol, I think, so I'm... I still want to try to just not knock it, not just knock everybody out, so... Never I have a somewhat reasonable patrol. And not being asshole, I'm gonna try to avoid doing it. <coughs> if I'm trying to interrupt everything. But we're supposed to place Laris. Where they both go nice. Freaking <coughs> tile floors are not making this any easier. Don't pay any attention to me, lady. Creep <coughs> into this corner. <clears throat> uh, man, people are having fun here. <clears throat> but those candle candles in the corner are making a bunch of lights. Just Who is there? Who are you? I see him. Hey, over here. Fuck you. Well, there goes my plans of not just knocking these guys out. Bugger. What was doing well there? It's gonna be rooms and rooms of people that's been knocked unconscious. Uh, are you standing in my way? Are you lying in my way right there? I do wish I had turned off collision for uh, unconscious people. Sometimes they also break. Okay. Suppose you have anything. <sighs> yeah. A coordinate coordinating people of different time zones can be. Get quite tricky. This fireplace seems okay. Yeah, it's just some cheap ass wine. I'm not gonna bother with. Uh, I haven't saved in a long time. 
for the game it's 17 minutes but considering how much i've been saving and reloading there's no way it's only 17 minutes since i saved right so getting past here might and one option is to just like just get up and run No, there's a couple of. Uh, there she comes, so I'm gonna have to. Uh, I think if I wait for her to come here, I can just run on the carpets. Uh, yeah, I have the base game. Uh, I don't have any of the expansions. I played like 10 hours, something like that. And I don't know, I just kind of ended up kind of getting a bit bored. So I don't deal too well with the mid game. I actually don't know if I, what I got to count as mid game even. No, it's not Kevil! Stop asking for Kevil! It's never Kevil. It's a brothel, there's like a hundred people in here. Stop reacting to me stepping on the stone, please. <coughs> yeah, I really should play that. Yeah, I want. I should revisit uh, Stellaris and. Well, at least the Loris and CK2. <laughs> oh, there's a water arrow. What's that? Nothing. Just glad it was nothing. Just stop doing drugs, please. Make new life hard for everyone. Those visions of yours. I uh, just thought it might be ne would be neat to just maybe get a few more cool peeps together for it. It might be cool to have like I don't know how well uh let's say how well it actually works playing a bunch of people. Uh, Could it be ambient volume? I'm gonna try to turn the ambient volume down. It's on the fourth slide. One, two, three, fourth. I'm gonna turn down to the second one. The music is way too loud here. There goes the guard. Right, there's two prostitutes patrolling the place. Don't mind me, I'm just. Don't hurt me. Who's there? I see him! Perfect, there's like no freaking shadows there at all. <coughs> why? Why am I so bad? Can somebody answer me why I'm so bad at saving? Uh, I may want to play with a mod, play it that myself either. I wouldn't mind playing with a mod. It's gonna be hot. It's 
gonna be hard with all the lights here and the people but like three people patrolling that section right out over there There's this asshole that keeps seeing stuff out of the edge of her vision, which it shouldn't. Glad it was not Sorry, nothing here now. Yeah, I think sh this one is not. She isn't too annoying, other than you know, seeing well to well. Seeing way too much out of the corner of her eyes. Hey, what was that? Yeah, so the curtains do block line of sight, but the problem is like the second where I can spot it through through the gap I think if if they had designed so that NPCs couldn't see through the gaps like this it this entire level would have been a lot nicer play on the water arrow thank you very much uh, I guess you could have jumped into the water as well and just swam past, but the artist is an idiot, so it makes a big splash when it jumps into the water. You know, this just the wind. This, this looks like a shadow. Nope, not a shadow. Okay. Sorry. Just gonna have to knock you out. Sorry about this. What's that? Uh, that awkward moment when you have an unconscious body and you don't know where to put it. This is there's way too much light here to hide a body. Uh. This was a horrible plan for my part. Oh well, sorry, guess it was nothing. We can actually drop her like right where she stood once I put up lights. Get back in the shadow and we'll only turn out that one over there as well, I think. Or maybe if I might be able to just drop into the water here stairs. Is, is someone over there? I don't know what that was. What is that? Nope. I can't drop into the water without making a ton of noise. As I expected. Yeah, so I'm believing it's nothing. It's best. That's best for both parties there. Mm -hmm. 
So you're just, uh, just creeping around trying to turn out every single... Every single little candle that we can find. Create some semblance of shadows to hide in. Well, this level has way too, way too many people and way too few shadows. I do want that candle turned off as well. Is that you, Kevil? Why do everyone suspect Kevil? What? What has this poor Kevil dude been doing that everyone suspects he is... Like, oh there's someone sneaking around. Must be Kevil again. I, I don't have any money. He's right here. Help! Help! Thief! Thief! Uh, I wanted you guys to use a Star Trek mod. Oh, oh yeah. That might, yeah, that might be fun. I have another NPC is coming this way, I need to... Wait for it to pass. Did I not uh just save? Did I not turn the Did turn the aim ambient down? I'm guessing the amp music doesn't go in the ambient. Who was that there? I saw something. Oh don't be silly girl, of course you didn't see Fuck she's She's gonna be looking okay good. I thought she was gonna start looking for me. I don't have any money. He's right here. Help! There's someone in here. A uh, beggar. Uh, the core mechanics are changed indeed. You're gonna have to spend some time learning it again. It's not too bad, you're just building small star bases to claim systems and spend influence on claims to get causes belly. You have insane army in the meantime. You save and try it away. Let's wait for enough. Uh, save it off that one, good. Yeah, I haven't played the. Uh, Turn off. I haven't played the vanilla version enough to build up a meta at all, so. Fuck me! I mean, it's a cool level, but there's uh, there's just too many people to make. To make it easy, and the shadows are a bit off at points. You have to be, you have to do a lot of like really testing where the edge of shadows actually are. <coughs> Instead of plant population creating borders and fighting your plants, you actually build things to claim system and fight over those. Okay, that's pretty cool. <coughs> Right, so those two guys leave and then that bastard comes along. I had completely forgotten about that nobleman. man. 
that cap gives me enough time to go over. Oh, private area. Okay. Oh. He wouldn't be me to say, huh? Patch made it feel more like other Paradox games strategically. Okay. Oh, fuck. Uh, I might be a bit buggered right now. Don't know how I can. Uh, I guess I could try moving in here. Once that woman with like this. God. I am way too close to people in way too little shadow right now. <coughs> oh my god. <laughs> and that's of course is a normal torch, not a can like can just snuff out. Of course, there's freaking tile floor all over the place in here. There we go. Nice bit of good old fashioned shadow. Just the way we like it. Oh, there's a guard coming. Let's get out of this way. Hmm. Well, that's rude. Actually, installing proper locks on their doors. Who goes ahead and does. What kind of people does stuff like that? Criminal, that's what. Who does it? Everybody out. Oh, this is a. Oh, hello there. I almost missed the cups on top of the fireplace there. That's just not actually a shadow wall. I'll drop you somewhere else to actually stay hidden. Right here is good. No one's gonna suspect the shadows. Mm, I don't think this actually counts as tile floor. I thought it would have made a lot more noise by now. Ooh, a love letter. Hello, Tyson. How are you doing? Ah, so the private area is not for private dances and stuff, private shows. Uh, it's actually where the uh, where the people working here sleeps. Okay. Having fun bashing people's head in. Yeah, I revert to my old sinful ways of just bashing in every head I come across. Uh, mainly because it's just uh, just too many people there. Ooh, just finished my first stream. Had a view, had four viewers in the Metal Gear Rising. Yeah, I heard you talking about setting up your first setting up the stream. I didn't know that was today. Uh, let me actually uh, mute please. Go throw a little follow there. Let's see, nights are endless and I'm without you. I miss your warm embrace. I'm so cold and alone in these dark holes. 
Madame Dementia treated us fairly and respectfully, yet everyone knows she only sees us as pawns for perverted fantasies. Uh, the Dark Hollow is such a strange place, I don't even know what it's supposed to be, but I guess it existed long before someone decided to turn it into a brothel. It must be centuries old, and I swear I can hear strange noises and even faint whisper sometimes. Chanel once told me she felt like the statues were silently judging her with their rigid stares. She left the brothel in a hurry a short while afterwards. Maybe it was just a result of solitude. I hope this letter will find you safely in your battlefield as my heart yearns to see you again your love is last. Yeah, let's not be an ass. Let's not go around stealing love letters. There's no need to be. It might be a thief, but there's no reason to be an asshole. There we go. Uh, yeah, the game don't allow, actually allow you to put stuff back in chests. Chests. So I'm just gonna pretend that's close enough. Yeah, how how was your first time? What does it? But if this is the private, yeah, four years for your first time is really good. Uh, yes, it's a fairly popular game. See if there's this is the private quarters for the. God, good. Good God, I'm glad this is actually carpeted. It is. If this is the area for just for a. Uh, for workers, it makes sense to not have a bunch of guards running around, because why would you need that? The guards are more to keep the patrons in check. Well, hello, well, 10 bit more of cash. Uh, but nobody left midstream, well that is pretty good. Yes. Hmm. I'm just trying to judge how loud this surface actually is. It's fairly silent. Uh, God would probably discover me if I tried to follow him, but unless I try to start like right, stay like right at his. Heels. I should be fine. Yeah, chat activities are very. is quite random. I mean, there's a bunch of people that just like to hang out as well. Yeah, you can't really expect too much activity. Use. At least I can't expect too much of it. Uh, I'm just gonna turn out. I probably don't need it, but I'm gonna turn out the lights because why not? I mean, as long as you have fun doing the streaming, that's pro that's my opinion the most important thing. Turn you out. <laughs> yeah, you do talk quite a bit. That is true. So I have five arrows. And then, uh, yeah, so here you have sort of like shabby tile floor. Well, here you got the proper tile floor as a beach to try to stealth across. Yeah, it's yeah, supposed to be a really good game. I should actually do it, play it at some point. I should also, oh, hello there. I should also stop saying I should. I should also just stop saying I should play games. I know I'm not gonna be able to get to it anytime soon. Uh, you're a good cook, but lately the food has been quite lackluster. I don't know if the new market sources are responsible for drive diving quality, but the patrons have been quite bothered by this. 
Uh, as for the noise you hear in the kitchen, these are probably all in your head. These mysterious places can get in your skin. Don't pay attention to them. Kitchen is annoying the valet. That seems to have been ambient volume for some reason. This is kind of awkward. Please don't turn around to me. It's been a nice guy and don't notice me. A bit. Oh my god. Oh my god. I got, I got so lucky with that guy turning like in a circle that way to walk out and not turning to his left. And open this thing. That's definitely a keeper symbol, so which means you just need to find. Is it gonna be possible to open at some point? Uh, no, don't want the spoon. Uh, no, I don't need this. not constantly playing Company of Heroes 2 with him. It seems like a nice game, but I don't know if I would... You can get bored with pretty much any game, right? Please don't notice me. Be nice ones, I would not want to knock you out this time, okay? Definitely hear some whispering here someplace. I'm not into constantly playing the same game. Yeah, I'm usually not that myself either. So see, I don't actually I'm not actually down in health. Oh, service key, okay, that's gonna come in handy. Definitely some whispering going on here. Okay, just yep, let's get down. Just double checking that there was no hidden switches up on the roof beam. Of places people put it in thief. Hey, what was that noise? Oh, fudgeicle. Uh. This could get a bit awkward. Oh, I forgot to start sneaking once I get out there. Uh... Come back! Oh, 
Okay, never mind. Uh, hiding spots, hiding spots, hiding spots. There's no hiding spots. Oh wait. Uh... Right, I got a flash. I keep forgetting to actually use the flash bombs. Huh. I love how I basically have like a chase through the brothel. I chased a guy through the brothel, tried to knock him out, and nobody noticed. <laughs> that is quite exceptional. Just get something to drink. Shut up, music. Uh, right, now we just have to get into that section again. It's gonna be a bit, it's gonna be easier and easier the more people we actually end up knocking out. No, of course there's no one here, just, <laughs> just imagining things. You know how it can be with creepy old places like this, just... <clears throat> it looks like this stuff is everywhere in the shadows. Do you actually own the Thief games, Solda? Or would you have to buy them to play them? Right, we knocked out both the people patrolling this section. Nice. Uh, so you just have to worry about people hearing us. See this. Service key. Would you look at that? Oh, do you want to check? Uh, yeah. Check the service section first. Just lock it up behind us. Yeah, this is definitely like. Definitely like a keeper architecture type of area. Electric lights. Wait, I gave you most of them? What? One drunker in there, I can't hear anyone else make much of noise. Oh, I thought those, was va those were valuable goblets. I'm just trying to pick up both of them. Uh, well, that's certainly not creepy at 
all just wreaked over entrances. That's always such a good sign. Uh, I'm actually gonna take a real hot shower can't resist. All right, see you later, Jason. Uh, gold, deadly shadows, and two. Uh, it might have been. Right, does service key work for this one as well? It does not, of course not. Oh, he's definitely looking this way. Good old... Good old drunk guards. Just, ins just inspecting the wine, making sure it's not poisoned, right? Just take the valuable button and we'll leave the guard alone. Don't see any reason at all to knock him out. Uh, let me actually just. Find a nice, nice dark shadow to make a save game in. Uh, of course, I don't go. This was. Oh, breath, oh, breath potion, okay. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to take a bit of a swim later on then. What are actually my main objectives here? Uh, I need, need to find the Chalice of Souls, which is the uh, name of this fan mission. Find information, steal a bunch of loot, and don't kill anyone. How are we doing on the loot by now? I don't... Yeah, we're not doing too well. Oh. Oh god, no. We don't, we don't really want mines. Uh, we're not allowed to kill anyone. He was, that's not my fault. He was dead when I found him. Uh, it's been two weeks and I haven't found anything about the secret passage. Either I'm a blind small or a ghost, I think we we fuddles. Well, there's this receded bookcase in the madame's quarter. But that's about it, really. Could be something behind it, but I haven't found a way to move it. I'm gonna check the bathroom, mind you. Heading with, heading with Celeste now. We'll talk about it on the morrow. I'll be at Kados. We'll talk grime of my body. Apple bath, Mugwort's bath, Jasmine baths, wine baths. I don't care if I shiver like an old prune. Uh, actually, I'm gonna keep that letter just so I remember the clue about the receipted bookcase. This is a, certainly a nice na part of na certainly a nice neighborhood. Let's 
Yes, yeah, just rubble from the statues. Sh sh shovel. Uh. <gasps> Possibly be something next next one over here. Okay, that doesn't sound like safe. There's a bunch of fires burning. One fire arrow. That was everything else down here. Okay. Yeah, right, you check the vine cellar with a drunk guard. What is actually true this? Uh that's creepy to the corner. It's not a good hiding spot, but uh, pretty good enough. Oh, it's definitely gonna be people walking around up there. I don't think anyone comes down here. Right there, yeah. So part of back into the public section of the brothel again. Uh, I know there's a couple of people that patrols up. Stairs there. The trolls walks past that walks past there at least. Running water? Hmm. Yeah, a bit of a private path section. Water arrows, yes, please. Well, that's not that's not very private. Toilets. Uh, speaking of toilets, I need to take a short toilet break. Just hide in here, and I'll be right back.
Right. Uh, oh, right. That's where I was hiding. Uh, so we got the left side of the brothel left to explore as well. Some upper sections. Is this a thief I see before me? Guards! Guards! There's a... Well, great. Uh, I didn't think he would come like down, try to go down the stairs. Perfectly honest. So I'm gonna get a good, good amount of water arrows. To be fair, I'm being real careful about not using them at all. But clearly, I need to do. Hello there, hidden moss arrow. Yeah, I can understand why they would give you a bunch of moss arrows. Uh, you know the tile surfaces you need to cross on this map. Right, I spent a lot of long and going to that room last time, which is why he is late now. Okay, so who do I know? Who do I know about that actually controls that, or has a Ruth going to that room and down that? Down on the left side. Uh, and obviously, there's the guy that caught me. There's at least one guy. There he comes. Uh, there's also the there's also the nobleman in brown. <coughs> Take care of those cat that pouch for you. Thank you very much for your donation. Hmm. I don't remember if there's any uh, any prostitutes or anything that goes down there. Well, actually, the yeah, I think yeah, I think the one that's just like a red and white outfit. Ups down here at times as well. Big electric light in the middle. Uh, is that tile floor? Is that a is that a good tile floor or the crappy tile floor? I think that might be the good one. Light. Some candles in the middle. I don't know what else is to be made in the room. Okay, so there's two guards. It's one that goes on like a circle and one that I think goes up and down. Alright, patrol the upper floor as well. Hmm. There's a bunch of stuff on the, to the right as well. I wish I, I wish I could hide over in that corner there to so I could see what's on the 
re in the rest of the room. Discard one. Not many blue is taking a sweet time. Guard number two and the other nobleman. Sorry, you're gonna have to go. Yes, you can drop in the toilet. Blame it on bad bubble movement or something. Oh fuck one of the guards heard me. Don't think you can hide for long. somewhere why did the second one aggro all of a sudden <sighs> oh god this is perfectly fine God, that's really not what I want to do. Uh, yeah, so I think I think one of the guards heard me knocking out the guy in blue, and started searching for me. And the other guy spotted the other guard searching and joined in. This before I knocked him out, just making sure. Yeah, I was, I was, I got a bit unlucky because I was just like, I was just a bit too slow with actually knocking the guy out. I knocked them out before they sp when they spot me they shout which uh, obviously people hear uh, but I think if I had knocked him out before he shouted it would have been fine hmm, thought I saw something Obviously you're mistaken. Oh, there's no shadow. That's a good old fashioned shadow. Oh, there's a girl over there as well. Right, so I'm just gonna pop out these. Is someone there? Who's there? Who said that? that fireplace over there. <laughs> right, the people upstairs can be a bit annoying. I might have to take them out before I... Oh my god, he comes in here? I don't know if I have enough hiding space. Inside to take a wrong turn. Yeah, just uh, stand there and appreciate the unlit fire blaze. Thank you very much. I want to get those, I think if I get the candles in the middle here, which is going to be reasonably nice and... Okay, I said get the candles in the middle.
Dum da 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 dum dum. What happened to the blue guy? Did he? Did Mr. Blue come back or did he get stuck in the toilet? Alright, there's Mr. Brown and the Guardian. Uh, I, I think I'm gonna have to wait for Mr. Brown to walk back. I don't think I have enough time. And there's Mr. Blue again, that's fine. just realized that I probably knocked out the NPC, I'd, or rather one of the prostitutes I didn't think I'd knocked out. Uh, so that's Mr. Blue opening the toilet door, she should be coming back any second. God, the guard's coming back through. Okay, that should give me a good... Time to turn that one out. Now we can start stealing from the table. Oh yes, all the valuables. Actually, not that many valuables. There's a couple of fruits left. Oh, I think those candles, those candlesticks up there look like they're from gold, so... Uh, I'm nabbing those as well as Mr. Brown leaves. Nothing's going on there over there, obviously. Why? Why is there light here? <laughs> Mr. Brown should take a while before he's back. The candlesticks are usually worth quite a decent amount. What? I have those on RNT as well, huh? Realize that. <coughs> See if I can may take out those candlesticks in the middle there's over there as well. I should have pretty good freedom of movement. <coughs> what have I been using water arrows on? Hmm. Where should I? Oh, yeah, I did waste two of them on the fireplace, right? Well, waste. I used one on the fireplace and then wasted one trying to take out the fireplace. And no one's reacting to this, to the place suddenly being really dark, which is nice. Mr. Guard, Mr. Brown is Selena as the second guard. And I believe we got quite a while before Mr. Blue comes back around. There's a guy upstairs, okay. Hmm. 
Something there. No, nothing here. Seems peaceful enough now. Let's continue normal patrols. Uh, that didn't make the place nearly as dark as I had hoped. There's still way too many people running around the place. I no clue how well I guess if I time it correctly I should be able to make it down for down that court of door to find some place to hide. Mr. Brown comes around. Is someone there? This would have been a good time if it wasn't for Mr. Brown. We're turning on the attorney in time soon. I'm gonna have to wait for both the guards again after he leaves. Probably leaves enough time for Mr. Blue as well. Yeah, there's Mr. Blue's toilet door. And both the guards, oh my god, this is Christmas. <coughs> One pickpocket coming up. What's going on? Nice, that was a pretty good executed drop into the corridor. Uh, probably won't thin out the herd of guards, though. Right Why? There's no reason they should have spotted me there. There we go. Uh, I think if I just hide him in the shadow, that's gonna be enough. I have to wait for guard number two to come around. To verify he doesn't spot this body. Mr. Brown and the guard. Hmm. Guards are not. Oh, they're sometimes being a bit aggro. They're not too bad, and there's plenty of darkness. Let's actually try just leaving them alone. Is that you? Too much coffees this morning. I'm twitchy as hell. Yeah, way too much Deep coffee. You should turn that down for your own health. Really, it's not good for you. Mr. Blue is still active, should be coming in a second. Oh, this might be too close. <coughs> Alright, okay. Yeah, that guy is not tight, tight loop. He is actually gonna have to go. You mess with me and your crow, oh, mean tapper boy! I forgot how quick they are to react. Uh, if I knock this guy out, where could I actually hide him? What? Hey! You! Yeah, so it, okay, so yeah, it is the noise I'm making, I think, that's triggering them. Oh, 
that was kind of awkward. Moment where you just swing a black jack right in front of someone's face. What? I think the other guard goes quite close to that wall over there. I just have to give it some time so people are not alerted by the noise of me dropping the body. You are just spotted the prostitute I didn't that I thought. Huh? What was that? Hello Don't lady man, how are you doing? <laughs> Who are you? What was that? He's armed! Ah. Guy over here! Help me! Crap! Show yourself! Mm. Oh, so Alright, what is that? I don't know what it You dog me! Ah, uh, yeah, you... I don't have anything to deal with this. How about you? This part is causing more trouble than truly. Okay. Yeah, that was all my all my fault. I okay. should have known that Mr. Blue was on his way out. They are just happily ignoring that body. How are you doing, Lady Nan? Hope you're doing well. Yeah, I should have known Mr. Blue was coming out of his room at any moment. I don't know why I thought I could just sneak past Mr. Mm -hmm. There's the guard number two coming. He's right. happily ignoring the Nothing unconscious now. guard. <coughs> Do you want to run over and grab the... Put out the candles with... I think Mr. Blue might catch me in the act. What's up? Yeah. Who's there? Hello? Why? Why do you think people are here? Just because you lost your purse doesn't mean there's thieves around. Hmm. Must have been rats. Probably impulsive. Why? Am I muted? No, no, I'm not muted. God, come on. There we go. Someone there. Who's that? Mm. Must have been rats. Why? Uh, what are they actually all treeing on right now? Hmm. Guess it was nothing. I mean, I should not be muted. I'm seeing OBS reacting to. Uh, me speaking so should be fine sneak across and no blue is hello there what's that sound who knows what it was <clears throat> well if you can't hear me you should probably <laughs> Should probably test your volume. Oh, okay. I see what this room is all about then. Guards! Thief! Don't let him get away! I saw him lying there, dead as night. Oh. <laughs> Fuck you, Mr. Blue, you're getting a blackjack. Just give me a second to get rid of the guard. Thief! There. Stop him! I see him! Help! Over here! Uh. Someone, get him. How about you? Ah. See? I'm tr 
I'm trying to be nice and not just knock everybody out, but this is what I get as a reward. Is this a... Good old little corner or key going on here. I think I'm training someone upstairs. You know what, Mr. Two, you're getting a blackjack as well. Oh, you know, we could fucking spot me. Who's there? <gasps> Who are you? Who are God! You? Oh, God. Uh, I think Mr. Why are they suddenly so freaking alert to my presence? They were completely fine with it just a minute ago. But yeah, we're definitely gonna have to show Mr. Blue here a good time. Mr. Brown might be allowed to stay conscious. Guard number two, I'm not so sure about. Here the body. Who was troll attempted first? Is someone there? Mr. Blue, you're getting a good old blackjack to the face. Yeah, everybody knows trolls and hobbits don't get along. Who's there? Oh. The trolls just try to eat hobbits, and you know, you're not the best way to make no. friends. Mr. Brown, are you? Are you messing around? Yes, it is. Good boy, you know it's just Never mind. There's no one here. Just mind your own business if you know what's good for you, Mr. Brown. <sighs> Awkward moment near just too far away. So I think you're not on the carpet here. Yeah, this level is incredibly busy. I've been trying to not just... I've been trying to unlearn the habit of just knocking everybody out, but... It's just too many people on this level to... I mean, I'm sure some people that's, uh, that are actually good at this game would be able to do it, but for me, I need to knock people out. There's too many. Who's there? I think Mr. Brown is I'm gonna knock out this good girl over here. Uh I have to use this room to stash people. Is that you, Kevin? Stash people. Stop tapping with me. I have to use this room to stash people in. I surrender! <clears throat> And I'm guessing once I get rid of all the bodies out in the hallway, pe people are not going to be complaining as much. Hey, 
I thought I saw a hidden switch. Yes, a well-visited brothel indeed. Yeah, nice little family-friendly pleasures going on up here as well. Oh, I need another 1300 to meet my goal. And that's number two going by. We have Mr. Blue over here. I'm being a bit careless here right now with the noise I'm making. Uh, so you played, so you played the thief games, Lidnan? Mm, no, I stopped. I'm um, gonna guess it's a yes because I don't think you get much people. Looking for a thief without having played it before. Uh, this number one. Uh, I got a, that stupid, stupid thing in the ceiling. It's gonna make this whole way a bit annoying, but I think you can deal with that. And I think this is a good spot to make a little safety save. Yeah, it's a long time ago, it was so much fun. I used to watch my older brother often too. Nice. I uh, didn't have patience to play it when I was a lot when I was younger. So I've been getting into it a bit last half year or so. Uh, except for some, except for some parts of the graphics, it's held up really well, actually. Like the gameplay and sound are still great. Uh, I'd say the main, I'd say the main issue is actually like the character, probably character models. Oh, make another nice little shadow over here. Is that no, this number two is not coming yet. Is there blue you locked in your room? My, what could you be up to in there if you need to lock your room? What rounds do you have for? It's got the lady and a snore, and I believe. Oh, wait, Mr. Blue, I think, was actually in the middle room that's open, huh? I think. Good deep nap. Good deep nap. I wonder if these like oh bugger. Uh right. Same. Uh throwing bodies on the ground does make noise. I have an accident. Just gonna put you both in just gonna tuck you both into bed here. Well in it doesn't look believable if you're not. Both need to get properly onto the bed. There we go. Here we go, proper position. Oh, okay. It's a Burke said, I think. Okay, random golden tiara laying around. Lustful taste and other satyrs and friskiness. Oh my! Oh my! She immediately noticed my ast 
aristocratic status, my subtle features, my fine beard, my mischievous eyes. Short the absolute opposition of the local louts, bovine feet, faces and soulless eyes. And they stood each other an instant after their eyes met. Uh, I don't think this is suitable for Twitch. <laughs> I wonder if these, I wonder if these are custom models or if they're actually from Thief 2. Yeah, if you're looking for more, for more Thief, Sola is at some point planning on playing it. That's gonna be a blind playthrough. I believe at least it's gonna be blind. And he's been watching me play a bit of it, but I think you mentioned missed most of the main missions, or original game at least. I can't remember these, those these models. Uh, I'm actually playing a fan-made mission, so this is this is not uh, this is not the original ones in the in the game. Hmm. How do I actually get upstairs? There is an upstairs section, but I haven't seen any stairs actually leading up there. Uh. There. Yeah, it is pretty well made. I've been playing... Uh, mostly been playing fan missions made by a guy called... S Mr. Brown, what are you doing? Yeah, I've mostly been playing Hello? fan missions made by a guy called Skacky, I believe, which uh, makes yeah, pretty yeah. good ones. Uh, uh, so we got a Mr. Black out there as well, which has a purse I kind of want to pick, but I would need to knock out pretty much everyone else to be able to get his purse. Oh, hello. Oh, Mr. Blue was probably in that room then, because this isn't a place patrons would get into. That's a cool idea to create a new mission, to create a new mission story. It's actually quite a thriving scene for it, uh, for Thief. Uh, not a whole lot of them. Uh, for Thief 1 though. I want to wait with the uh, fan missions for Thief 2 until I've actually played the base game. Because uh, a lot of the time they have like slides, they ref make references to the store and such. Right, so this is how you actually make your way up to the second floor. Yeah, second floor, yeah. Mm, wouldn't surprise me if one of those opened up. Well, there, sh there should be... Uh, in about a half year or so, there should be a lot more of the... More missions available for Thief 1. Because uh, uh, they're running a competition on... They're running a competition on creating new 
new fan missions uh, because of the 20th anniversary, I believe it is right now. This hallway seems to be not very well patrolled, I say, as I. I guess that's, uh, that's the. Uh... Okay, that's up there's a balcony f that's overlooking the dining hall, okay. Seems to be pretty much the only guard actually. Yeah, because this is not a big section, right? Oh, there's a lot more here in the upper floor than I thought, huh? Alright, thanks a lot for stopping by and keep me company. I really appreciate people just coming and talking. God, shadows! Fuck! No, nothing! Yeah, sometimes if they're not in a like a weird I go weird alert state, you can manage to knock them out before I spot you. Even if they're actually searching. And thanks a lot for that follow as well. And have a good night. No, this place is just weirdly lit. Okay. So it was that uh, those candles over there that was making me stand out, but yeah, just a bit weird. Stop your humming, please. Hmm. Let us see what. Yeah, so he's just up to here, walking down there, back and forth. Uh, we got a. No. Yeah, I think it's gonna be risky doing anything up here right now. We had a pretty good time because he has a spectrum for a long while. Actually, reasonably dark. Uh, yes, this. Yeah, this upper balcony section was actually less annoying than I thought. I expected there to be a lot of guards. I mean, I did knock out one of the two. And it's nice being back on the cheap tile floor as well. Not just everybody making a ton of, not just making a ton of noise all the time. Oh, so you just go there. A good old rank and then turn back around again, okay. Uh, okay, so, yeah, so you, you the guy stand, I spotted standing up here, okay. What is that we got over there? Hmm. Yeah, we can, uh, I think you gonna knock this guy out. Hmm. Hmm. 
There's a guard over there as well, so I'm just gonna move him a bit. For him getting spotted. Uh, yeah, I think I'm actually gonna have to call it a call it quits as well. Uh, I'll save that one, why not? Uh, it is getting quite late here as well. Let us see if there is there anybody online we could host up though. Uh, do, 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 do. Is there anyone else actually playing Thief? Yes, there is. Uh, just speedrunning. Hmm. Yeah, I think I will just host up uh, Dash Retro. Uh, you should also bunch. If anyone doesn't know, usually there's a bunch of uh, retro, retro games on actual original hardware, but right now he's playing some uh, he's playing some rock band instead. Yeah, I'm gonna host him up over there for a bit, and then I'll head to bed. Yeah, thanks a lot for stopping by, keeping me company, and for following, and have a good night.